be so busy improving yourself that you have no time to criticize others with this very important quotation let's start the video good morning all of my friends today we are going to discussing about some important current affair questions so let's start without dealing anything all the best okay let's start first question on your screen answer the following statement about article 131 of the indian constitution supreme court has the exclusive jurisdiction to hear and determine the dispute originating between states and union original jurisdiction or jurisprudence original jurisprudence of the supreme court does not extend to a dispute arising out of a treaty or an agreement with which continues to be in operation the exclusive jurisdiction of the supreme court is not applicable to cases where another body has a jurisdiction under other provisions of the constitution which are the correct all are the given statement is correct 1 2 and 3 is the right answer let's see you know that article 131 deals with the original jurisdiction of the supreme court what do you mean original jurisdiction simply mean this is the last nahi this is the antim nahi balki ek matra nyaalay jo aise mamlon ko dekh sakta hai usi ko kehte hain original jurisdiction that means the supreme court of india in any dispute that involves a question of law or fact on which the existence of the legal right depends article 131 instructs exclusive jurisdiction to the supreme court to hear and determine the dispute originating between states between states and the union under article 131 original jurisprudence does not extend to a dispute arising out of a treaty agreement covenant engagement which continues to be in operation the exclusive juris original jurisdiction of the supreme court is not applicable two cases where another body has jurisdiction under the other provisions of the constitution let's see example include article 262 interstate water dispute article 280 matter matters referred to a finance commission article 219 adjustment of a certain expenses and pension between the union and the states big try l lake big trail lake where it is it is alaska this is alaska big trail trail lake is one of the alaska's newest lakes and one of the largest methane emission hot spot in arctic big trail lake is a thermocast lake it's a thermocast that mean which signifies it formed due to the perma frost thaw perma frost ya perma frost is a terrain that remains frozen all year the perma frost in the inner alaska features large wedges of actual ice locked within the frozen earth when the glacier melt the earth surface collapses forming a sinkhole that can overflow with water 
as an outcome the thermocast lake forms a newly formed thermocast lake in alaska releasing methane bubble next question consider the following statement about unesco mondi mondika cult mondia cult unesco mondia cult conference what is this the aim of the conference is to build a resilient culture sector in the line the united states sustainable development goal sdg india is the president ya president of unesco mondi cult conference 2020 which is being held in new delhi which are the correct okay which are the correct statement i think uh, which are incorrect which are incorrect only and only b is incorrect you know that unesco world conference on cultural policy and sustainable development mondi ya mondi cult 2022 the conference will be convened by unesco 40 years after the first mondi cult world conference on cultural policy held in mexico city in 1982 24 years after the unesco world conference on cultural policy for the development held in stockholm in 1998 the unesco mondi cult 2022 world conference will be hosted from 28 to 30 september 2022 by the government of mexico as the world enters the last decade of the action for the implementation of the united nation sustainable development goals cultural has 11 SDG crucial role to play in SDG 11 that is max cities human settlement inclusive safe resilient and sustainable indian delegation headed by ministry of state of for culture will be represented at the unesco mondi cult 2022 next question about taj trapezium john central government in exercise of the powers conferred under the epa 1986 bharat protection act 1986 has constituted the taj trapezium john pollution authority in 1998 ttj that means taj trapezium zone is defined the area of 10400 square kilometer around the taj mahal to protect the monument from pollution it comprises the three world heritage sites taj mahal agra fort fatehpur sikri which are the correct i think it's a very One, two, and three is the right answer. Central government exercised the powers given under the Environment Protection Act, given under the Environment Protection Act, 1986, constituted Taj Mahal, the Taj Trapezium Zone Pollution Authority in 1998. TTJ is defined. the area of the 10400 square kilometer around the taj mahal to protect the monuments from the pollution ttj is so named since it is located around the taj mahal is shaped like a trapezium it comprises monuments including three world heritage sites the taj mahal agra fort 
एंड फतेहपुर सिकरी रिसेंटली सुप्रीम कोर्ट डायरेक्टेड द आगरा डेवलपमेंट अथॉरिटी टू स्टॉप द ऑल कॉमर्शियल एक्टिविटीज विद इन दी फाइव हंड्रेड मीटर्स रेडियस ऑफ ताजमहल यूनेस्को वर्ल्ड हेरिटेज साइट Consider the following statement about unlawful activities prevention act ufa tribunal the tribunal consists of only one person who has to be high court judge all expenses incurred for the tribunal are borne out of the consolidated fund of india the government order banning an organization can come into effect only when the ufa tribunals confirm it which are the incorrect i think c is incorrect so the koi bhi incorrect nahi hai constitutional the constitution of tribunal tribunals consist of only one person who has be a high court judge if the vacancy occurs in the tribunal the center appoints another judge and proceeding continue from the stage and which the vacancy is filed the field the center is to provide to the central to the tribunal st- such staff as necessary for the discharge discharge of its function all expenses incurred for for tribunal are born out of the consolidated fund of india the government order banning an organization would not come into effect until the tribunal has confirmed it however in the exceptional circumstances the notification can come into effect immediately once the reason for it are recording in writing the tribunal can endorse or reject it the center banned the popular front of india pfi deeming the organization an unlawful association under the unlawful activities prevention act ufa consider the following statement about united nation water course convention uwc it is a only treaty governing share fresh water resources that is universal applicability the use of the international water courts for navigation are not within the scope of the present convention india is not india is a signatory to the convention which are the correct about nations water course convention i think b is the right answer only third is incorrect united nation convention on the law of the non navigation usage of international water courses unwc in 1997 is the only treaty governing shared fresh water resources that is of universal applicability the present convention applies to use of international water sources and their waters for purposes other than navigation and the measures of protection preservation management related to the use of those water sources or water courses and their waters the usage of the international water courses for navigation is not within the scope of the present convention except in so far as the other uses affect navigation or affect aided by navigations both india and china are not signatories to the convention so why it should be out of them in the recent context of the increasing frequency and the intensity of floods in many parts of the world unwc convention state 
that water course states sell individually where appropriate jointly take all appropriate measure to prevent or mitigate conditions that may be harmful to the other water courses states the archaeological survey of india asi has discovered a treasure trove of ancient relics at the bandavgarh tiger reserve in madhya pradesh why it's so amusing sir the question in bandavgarh the buddhist caves and stupas and brahmani inscription discovered back to the 2 century the hindu temples dead back to the 9th to 11th century vara sculpture found here is the world largest vara sculpture dating back to the 9th to 11th century the time period of finding covered the region of the king sri bhim sena maharaj Kota Siri and Maharaj Bhatta Deva. In the Brahmi inscription, the ancient cities like Mathura and the Kosambi and Parva, Pratava, Prabhatava. Banagora Vito Omno Deka. Yes, it's in Madhya Pradesh. Archaeological survey has discovered the treasure troop to ancient relics at the Banagora Tiger Reserve in MP. Consider the following statement about Sahid Uddham Singh. Uddham Singh के बारे में पूछा जा रहा है. He was associated with Ghadar Party and Indian Workers Association as a Hindustan Socialist Republican Association members. He was one of the revolutionists involved in the Central Assembly bombing case. He assisted. He assisted. He assisted. He assisted brigadier general dyer who was the responsible for the amritsar massacres in 1990 he was the founder of the azad party and of sort of suit of the gadar movement i think dusra statement to aise hi kaat dijiye isme correct pucha ja raha tha teen char should be a part of your answer None is the answer. Nine, one and four is the right answer. One and four, yes, of course. He was associated with other party in Indian Workers Association. Let's see. It was during the time in the United States he got deeply involved in the Gadar movement and become one of its prominent activists. One of the prominent activists. Udham Singh illegally migrated to US in 1924 via Mexico eventually set settling in San Francisco the epicenter of the gadar movement in the North America as a member of the US based gadar movement Udham Singh acquainted himself with its literature and traveled across the country on behalf of the party to recruit members and raise funds he arrived in india with the intention of accelerating and radicalizing the anti colonial struggle bringing with him arms and gadarite propaganda gadarite propaganda however on 13th august 1927 he was arrested in amritsar under the arms act udham singh was sentenced to 5 years imprisonment since he was difficult to he was difficult prisoner for the authorities to manage he was transferred from one jail to another it was one of the those jails that the mate bhagat singh it was in one of those jails he met bhagat singh bhagat singh it is yeah it was one of the those jail that bhagat singh met him. Bhagat Singh and other revolutionaries from the Hindustan Socialist Republican Association (HSRA) were imprisoned in Min 
Mian Wali jail from killing J.P. Saunders and bombing the Legislative Assembly, Uddan Singh quickly befriended Bhagat Singh and was so captivated by him charisma and he called him his guru and the best friend and carried a photo of him in his wallet. Uddam Singh quickly befriended Bhagat Singh and was so captivated by his charisma that he called him his guru and best friend and carried a photo of him in his wallet. You know about that what happened in is known as the patent assign, assign patent as assign or the loan assign as assign who sought dead Michael O. Dyer, the Lieutenant Governor of Punjab under whose administration the infamous Amritsar massacres took place, who later even endorsed Brigadier General Dyer the perpetrator of the killing. In addition to his involvement with the Gadar party, Singh also launched his one party, a so-called Ajat party, as an offshoot of the Gadar movement. Prime Minister Modi ji tribute to martyrs ahead of Independence Day. Next question about which of the following pair is correctly match. One side is solar power plant, another is state Rama Gundam. Floating solar power plant is a Telangana Kayar Kulam floating solar power plant, Tamil Nadu Kayam Kulam, Kumuthi solar power plant, Kerala, or Badla solar power park, Rajasthan. Which are the correct? Absolutely, one should be answer one, two, and three, and only and only one and four is the right answer. In the recent event, the Prime Minister dedicated and laid the foundation stone of the various green energy project of NTPC worth bounds of crore. He inaugurated 100 megawatt Rama Gundam floating solar power project floating solar project in Telangana and the 92 megawatt Kaya, Kayam Kulam floating solar project in Kerala. He laid the foundation stone of 735 megawatt Nokha solar project in Rajasthan. Kumuthi solar power project is a photovoltaic power station. Kumuthi that is in Rama Nathpuram district that is in Madurai Tamil Nadu. Kumuthi is in Tamil Nadu. Badla ya Badala solar park is spread in Badala district Jodhpur Rajasthan. Pinkton. Pinkton Island is recently news. Where it is? Pinkton Island. Pinkton. That is in China. China military exercise comes ahead of US Speaker Nancy Pelosi plans to visit the island country, Taiwan. China said it was conducting military exercising of its coast opposite Taiwan after warning Speaker Nancy Pelosi of the US Home Representative is scrapped possible plans to visit the island democracy. It's a Fujiana province. It's a Pinton Island. Fujiana province me padega. China me padta hai Pinton Island. China announced a military exercise near this region. Consider the following statement about Financial Service Center. International Financial Service Center, IFSC, it has been established under the Special Economic Zones Act 2005. All the members of IFSC authority will have a term of five years and are not eligible for reappointment, which are the correct about. International finance 
self service center i think only and only d because neither one nor two you know about that international financial service center authority ifsca has been established in 2020 under the international financial service center authority act 2019 it is a headquarter in at a gift city in gandhinagar gujarat the international financial service center authority will consist of nine members appointed by the central government all the members of the ifsc authority will have a term of 3 years subject to the appointment pm modi laid the foundation stone of ifsca headquarter in gandhinagar consider the following statement with respect to monitor of illegal killing of elephants mic program monitoring of illegal killing of elephants that means mic program the objective of the mic program is to set out in the bonn convention all the mic sites in india are located in eastern and north eastern in india the mic program is entirely dependent on donor support second statement is should be out of them so only three is the right answer you know the objective of the mic program are set out in the convention on the international trade in endangered species under the resolution 10 by 10 convention migratory species also known as the bonn convention the mic sites in india are chirang rihu rihu elephant reserve dimoli elephant dihang elephant patkai garo hills eastern doa mayurbanj elephant shivalik mysur nilgiri wayanad they are located in south as well as mic program is entirely dependent on the donor support the european union has been most important donor for the mic program and has funded the implementation in africa since its inception in 2011 consider the following statement about drones rules 2021 an approval from the local body is required for operation of drones in green zones law enforcement agency have been empowered under the rules to declare a temporary red zone for specified period every drone including those meant for r&d purpose is required to be registered with the digital sky platform only and only two is the right answer you know every drone except for those meant for research development and testing purpose is required to be registered except research development testing okay every drone and should have a unique identification number unin an air space map of the country segregating the entire air space into red yellow green zones is available on the digital sky platform operation of drones in the red and yellow zones is subject to approval of the central government and the concerned air traffic control authority respectively however no approval is required for operation of drones in green zones the state government of the union state government Indian Territory Administration and Law Enforcement Agency have been empowered under the rules to declare a temporary red zone for a specified period. Drones are required to have a necessary type certification issued by a Director General of Civil Aviation (DGCA). No type certification is, however, required. in the case of nano drones that is up to 250 grams and all up weight and model drones for research and recreation purpose consider the following statement about space liability convention of 1972 space liability convention of 1972 the launching states are liable for the damage caused by the their space objects on the surface of the earth 
the convention also holds the launching states responsible for the space junk crashing back to the earth which are the correct about liability convention of space 1972 i think only one is correct space liability convention of 1972 defines responsibility in the case a space object cause harm the treaty says that a launching state shall be absolutely liable to pay compensation for damage caused by its space object on the surface of the earth or to aircraft and liable for damage due to its fault in space the convention also provides for procedures for the settlement of the claims for damage there is a no law such against space junk crashing back to the earth there is a no law against the space junk crashing back to the earth oh, it is a news debris from the chinese rocket fell back to the earth over malaysia answer the following statement about international north south transport corridor instc INSTC is a multimodal transportation established by India Russia Iraq in St Petersburg 2000 this corridor connects Indian Ocean past Persian Gulf to the Black Sea via Iran i think only and only c because both are incorrect you know about that international north south north south transport corridor is 7 1200 km long it's a multimodal transportation network encompassing sea road rail routes to the offer the shortest routes of connectivity it has been established september 2000 in st petersburg by iran russia india for the purpose of promoting transportation cooperation among the member states it links indian ocean to the caspian sea via persian gulf indian ocean caspian sea persian gulf into the russian and northern europe this is the north south corridor chahwar port to be linked with INSTC to enhance the connectivity with central asia consider the following statement regarding chakma and hajong community chakma and hajong community they fled myanmar and migrated to arunachal pradesh in 1964 1965 they have been granted citizenship under the citizenship amendment act 2019 which are the correct i think d neither one nor two because they fled earth wise earth while east pakistan now bangladesh they fled from bangladesh in 1964 1965 and come to india and settle in arunachal pradesh they are ethnic people who live in chitgaon hills tracts most of which are located in bangladesh Chakma and Hajong migrants had submitted their citizenship application under the section 5 of the 1955 Citizens Act the rest are the citizens by birth as per the section 3 of the 1955 Citizenship Act they don't directly come into the ambit of the Citizenship Amendment Act because Arunachal Pradesh is out of them exempted from the CAA since it has an inner line permit to regulate the entry of the outsider arunachal pradesh suspend the residential proof certificate upsets chakma hajong bodies al najha four al najha four ya al naj naj four is a joint collective exercise conducted between india and se oman Fourth edition Oman India Joint Military Exercise Al Najha Four between Indian Army and Royal Army of Oman. 
कंसिडर द फॉलोइंग स्टेटमेंट अबाउट मिशन अमृत सरोवर मिशन अमृत सरोवर इज एम एट डेवलपिंग एंड रिजुवेनेटिंग द 75 वाटर बॉडीज इन ईच डिस्ट्रिक्ट ऑफ द कंट्री 75 वाटर बॉडीज इन ईच डिस्ट्रिक्ट ऑफ द कंट्री हस्कराचार्य नेशनल इंस्टीट्यूट फॉर स्पेस एप्लीकेशन एंड जियो इंफॉर्मेटिक्स विशाख एन इज इन द टेक्निकल पार्टनर फॉर पार्टनर फॉर दिस मिशन नीति आयोग इज द इंप्लीमेंटिंग एजेंसी एट द स्टेट लेवल विच आर द करेक्ट about amrit sarovar only one and two with the view to the conserve water for the future prime minister launch a new mission that is amrit sarovar in 2022 the mission is aim at developing 75 rejuvenating 75 water bodies in each district of the country as a part of the celebration of azadi ka amrit mahotsav in the total that would lead to the creation of 50000 water bodies of the size about an acre और मोर भास्कराचार्य नेशनल इंस्टीट्यूट फॉर स्पेस एप्लीकेशन एंड जियो इंफॉर्मेशन विशाख एम हैज बीन इंगेज एज ए टेक्निकल पार्टनर फॉर द मिशन द मिशन वर्क थ्रू द स्टेट एंड डिस्ट्रिक्ट थ्रू द रूल फोकसिंग वेरियस स्कीम सच एज महात्मा गांधी मनरेगा फोर्टीन फाइनेंस कमीशन ग्रांट्स प्रधानमंत्री कल्याण कृषि सिंचाई योजना सब स्कीम सच एज वाटर सेट डेवलपमेंट कॉम्पोनेंट हर खेत को पानी बिसाइड स्टेट्स वन स्कीम इट मे ऑल्सो बी मैंसन दैट द मिशन इंकरेजेज मोबलाइजेशन ऑफ सिटीजन नॉन गवर्नमेंट रिसोर्सेज फॉर सप्लीमेंटिंग दीज एफर्ट्स द मिशन हैज बीन लॉन्च विद ए होल गवर्नमेंट अप्रोच इन सिक्स मिनिस्ट्रीज डिपार्टमेंट नेमली डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ रूरल डेवलपमेंट and department of land resources department of drinking water and sanitation department of water resources ministry of panchayati raj ministry of forest environment and climate change many ministries are working concerning the following statements national water ways passes through the four states national water 2 on river brahmaputra water system national water 3 runs from the kollam to kottapuram in kerala National Water Four includes the River Godavari and River Krishna water system, which are the correct, incorrect. Incorrect one definitely means that none is the incorrect. How it possible? Yes, of course it is possible. It was Ganga Bhagirathi, N W one Ganga Bhagirathi, Hooghly River system that is called Haldia Alabad location U P Bihar Jharkhand West Bengal. N W two इस ब्रह्मपुत्रा रिवर इस धुबरी सदिया धुबरी टू सदिया लोकेशन आसाम एन डब्ल्यू थ्री वेस्ट कोस्ट कैनल पट्टापुरम कोल्लम चंपाकारा उदयगोल मंडल कैनल लोकेशन इन केरला आकी नाडा पुडीचेरी केनाल स्ट्रेच समथिंग भद्रचलम एंड राजमुंद्री कृष्णा रिवर स्ट्रेचेज बिटवीन वजीराबाद टू वजियावाड़ा एन डब्ल्यू फोर कंसर्ट द फॉलोइंग स्टेटमेंट अबाउट स्मॉल सेटेलाइट लॉन्च व्हीकल एस एस एल बी स्मॉल सेटेलाइट लॉन्च व्हीकल या व्हीकल डिजाइन डिजाइन टू ऑर्बिट सेटेलाइट वेइंग लेस देन फाइव हंड्रेड के जी इन लो अर्थ ऑर्बिट It is a three-stage rocket configured with three solid propulsion stages and liquid propulsion-based velocity trimming module as a terminal stage. Which are the correct about SSLB? I think only and only C. Both statements are correct. SSLB, small satellite launch vehicle, is a rocket that is designed to orbit satellites. जिसका वजन 500 kg के आसपास हो और उससे कम हो, इसको 300 लो अर्थ ऑर्बिट एंड तीन सौ के जी टू सन सेंट्रल ऑर्बिट में फेंक देगा उठा के कोई भी उपग्रह को एस एस एल बीज ए स्मॉल सेटेलाइट लॉन्च वेकल हंड्रेड वन टेन मास एट इस रो इट विल टेक ओनली बहत्तर आवर्स टू इंटीग्रेट अनलाइक द सेवनटीन डेज टेकन नाउ फॉर ए लॉन्च वेकल 
the other features include flexibility in accommodating multiple satellites, launch on demand flexibility, minimal launch infrastructure requirement, etc. Only just to be taken only Bahatra over to integrate. So, Jordan Bath Matra or Lata, you are Bathar Gantame. It is a three stage launch vehicle configured with three solid propulsion stage and liquid propulsion based velocity trimming module as a terminal stage. Third stage solid motor housed inside closed interstage second stage and vented interstage and first stage and core base round finds isro will launch first flight of sslb on soon consider the following statement regarding the united nations peacekeeping force unpf Peacekeepers are recruited directly by the selection committee of the United Nations General Assembly and are also called UN Army. They are often referred to as a blue beads or blue helmets, which are the correct. Two is definitely correct, and one is I don't incorrect. Peacekeepers remain members of their respective armed forces. Peacekeeper. Remain members of their respective armed forces, don't constitute an independent UN army as the UN does not have much such force. In the case where direct UN involvement is not considered appropriate or feasible, the council authorizes the regional council or regional organization such as a NATO. Economic community of Western African state or a coalition of willing countries to undertake the peacekeeping or peace enforcement task. They are often referred to as blue beards or blue helmets because of their light blue beards or helmets. In recent violent conflict in the DRC, two BSF personnel were killed. Mineral security partnership seen in news used in this context of mineral security partnership. It's a rare earth material. United States, along with partner countries, Jismaki, Australia, Canada, Germany, UK, announced the formation of the mineral security partnership. A pact will focus on securing. A steady supply of rare earth material for its member. Mineral security partnership will help the members' countries ensure they have a reliable supply of rare earth material in a year to come, which are used to manufacture electric vehicle as well as battery for consumer electronics. MSP members include Australia, Canada, Finland, Germany, France, Japan, Republic of Korea, Sweden, United Kingdom, United States. European Commission, but not India. Which of the following pair is are incorrectly matched? Satkosia Gorge, Nanda Lake, Bebnard Wetland Complex, Ranga, Rangana, Rangana, Kittu, Bird Century. Which are the incorrectly matched? Incorrectly matched. I think uh, you know Satkosia Gorge. Where is it? Devnar Wetland Complex. I think one, three, and four is uh, incorrect. India adds ten more wetlands designated as a Ramsar site. The total sixty-four site covering an area twelve lakh fifty thousand hectare. Thus, new sites to include किया गया है जिसमें कि छह तमिलनाडु से और एक जो है गोवा से है कर्नाटक से है मध्य प्रदेश से ओडिशा से तमिलनाडु का जो कोना थंकुल्लम बर्ड सेंचुरी गल्फ ऑफ मन्नार ऑफ मैराइन बायोस्फीयर रिजर्व देवनार वेटलैंड कॉम्प्लेक्स बिलोड डी बर्ड सेंचुरी वेथंगल बर्ड सेंचुरी 
उधाया मार्थंग मार्थंग दम पूरम बर्ड सेंचुरी उड़ीसा का सतकोसिया गौज गोवा का नंदे नंदा लेक केरला का देवनार वेटेंड कॉम्प्लेक्स कर्नाटक का रंगा थिट्टू बर्ड सेंचुरी मध्य प्रदेश का सिरपुर वेटलैंड्स इंडिया एड्स टेन मोर वेटलैंड्स डेजिग्नेटेड रामसर साइट एक्सरसाइज पिच ब्लैक पिच ब्लैक इट इज बाइनियल एक्सरसाइज हॉस्टेड बाय ऑस्ट्रेलियन एयर फोर्स Only the members of the quad grouping are allowed to participate in this exercise. Which black? Which are the correct? I think A is the right answer. Continuing series of military exercise in countries in Indo-Pacific, the Indian Air Force will join sixteen other nations with sixteen other nations, including quad partners. Later this month for exercise pitch black. The biennial exercise hosted by the Australian Air Force, pitch black. The exercise will host up to twenty-five thousand, twenty-five thousand eight, twenty-five hundred personnel and up to hundred aircrafts from the around the globe, including partners, part, uh, partitions, a yeah, participants of Australia, France, Germany, Indonesia, India, Singapore, Japan. Korea, UK, Philippines, Thailand, UAE, Canada, Netherlands, Malaysia, New Zealand, and US. Significantly, Germany, Japan, and Republic of Korea will be participating fully for the first time. Oh, Germany, Japan, and Republic of Korea. India to participate operation pitch black in Australia. Consider the following statement: Totem leaf, totem leaf, curl, disease. सीएल क्लू सीएल सीएल कूड ये वायरल डिजीज ऑफ प्लांट्स कॉज बाय वाइट फ्लाई अटैक्स द लीव्स ऑफ इन्फेक्टेड कॉटन कर्ल बोथ अपवर्ड एंड डाउनवर्ड व्हिच आर द इनकरेक्ट सीएल कड आई थिंक नाइदर वन नो टू द बटरफ्लाई नहीं है वाइट फ्लाई attacks white fly attacks have lead to a spread of cotton leaf curl disease across the cotton belt of punjab haryana rajasthan cl could a viral disease that affects the overall growth of the cotton plant and in hits its yield leaves of infected cotton curl both upward and downward White fly attacks have lead to a cotton curl leaf disease in Punjab, Rajasthan, Haryana. Answer the following statement regarding. Convention on International Trade in Endangered Species of Wild Fauna and Flora sites. All the members of the states of the United Nations are party to the treaty. Site is a legally binding on parties. Their treaty consists of three appendix. Appendix one having the highest protection. You know about that? One should be out of them. Is the two and three is the right answer? Sites is a multilateral treaty. to protect endangered plants animals all the member states of united nation are a party to treaty with the exception of drc federated state of micronesia haiti kiribati marshall island nauru south sudan east timor turkmenistan tuvalu are not the member of sites site is uh, sites is a legally binding on the parties it does not take the place of the national law rather it provides a framework respected by each party which must adopt their one domestic legislation to implement sites at the national level sites was drafted as a result of resolution 
adopted in 1963 at a meeting of the members of the IUCN. Each protected species or population is included in one of the three lists called appendices. The appendix that list a species or the population that reflects the extent of the threat to it and controls that apply to the trade appendix one and about barasso species are species that are threatened and extinction and are may be affected by the trade commercial in wild caught species man of these species illegal however it's permitted only in exceptional licensed circumstances appendix 2 lagbhag 21000 species hai jo ki theek hai ye threaten nahi hai with the extinction ka se koi chinta baat nahi hai lekin become so less that the species incompatible hai aur site ke appendix 3 mein 170 species hai the list is one of the country has asked the sites controlling in trade in species Wildlife Protection Amendment Bill is to make Indian laws compatible to the sites. Changara goat, the Changara goat, Changara goat, Jovial Changara goat, but it is Sir Ladakh, Changtai, the Changpangpa, the Changara is a breed of Kashmir goat native to the high plateau of ladakh in northern india it is closely associated with the nomadic changpa people of the changthang plate it may also be known as a ladakh pashmina or kashmiri the intense cold of region cause the goats to grow thick under coat which is harvested to produce the fine pashmina trade of kashmiri Consider the following statement regarding Mahatma Gandhi National Rural Employment Guarantee Act, Manrega. It aims to enhance the livelihood security in the rural areas by providing at least three months of wage, at least three months of wage employment. Social audit is mandatory for works carried out under Manrega. Manrega or Manrega scheme. forms a part of the core to core of the core scheme which are the correct first statement absolutely incorrect dusra sahi hai tisra ke bare mein bataiye aap to do aur teen sahi hai it aims to enhance the livelihood security in rural area by providing at least 100 days of wage employment in the financial year to at least one member of the every household who the adult members volunteer to do on a skill manual work women are guaranteed one third of the jobs made are available under the manrega section 17 of the manrega had mandated 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 the social audit of the all works executed under the manrega ministry of rural development mrd the government of the india is monitoring the entire implementation of in scheme in association with the state government for the core of the core scheme like mahatma gandhi national rural employment guarantee act manrega the union government gives majority of the funding to states A report stated that fourth South East Indian state had a top misuse from Mumbai. Consider the following statement regarding fair and remunerative price (FRP). FRP is the price declared by the government, which mills are legally bounding, which means legally bound, bound. legally bound to pay the farmers for the kin procured from them the payment of frp across the country is 
governed under the Essential Commodity Act 1955. I think both statements are right. FRP is the price declared by the government which mills are legally mills are legally bound to pay to the farmers for the cane procured for them. Mills owner have the option to signing an agreement with farmers which would allow them to pay the FRP in installments. Delays in payment can attract the interest up to the 15% per annum. Wow. And the sugar commissioner can recover unpaid FRP as a due in the revenue recovery by attaching the properties of the mills. The payment of the FRP across the country is governed by the sewer can control order 1966. FRP across the country is governed by the sugar can control order 1966 issue under the Essential Commodities Act 1955, which mandates the payment within 14 days. Within 14 days, the date of the delivery of the claim. Chauda din ke andar agar paisa nahi mila, agar sugar can ke utpadko ko, sugar can ke mill maliko ke dwara, to samaj lijiye. It has been determined on the recommendation of the Commission for Agriculture, Cost and Prices. और ये एक तरह से अनुमोदन किया जाता है सीएसीपी के द्वारा किस किस से कैबिनेट कमेटी ऑन इकोनॉमिक अफेयर्स से अनुमोदन की जाती है सीएसीपी के द्वारा एफआरपी का ठीक है तो इसका डिटरमिनेशन कौन करता है तो सीएसीपी करता है लेकिन इसका फाइनल डिसीजन जो है या अनाउंसमेंट जो है वो सीईसीए करता है तो आपको पता होना चाहिए सेंटर ने बढ़ा दिया है एफआरपी और सुगर के अच्छी बात है Allah question and consider the following statement with respect to National Anti-Doping Bill 2022. Anti-Doping Bill ke The bill prohibits athletes, athlete support personnel and other person from engaging in doping. The bill prohibits for constituting NADA the bill provides not prohibiting the bill provides for the constituting nada as a statutory head by the director general appointed by the central government it seeks to give effect to the international olympic committees international convention against doping in sports which are the correct i think given a statement all of the above no only one one and two are right Bill prohibits athletes, athlete support personnel and other person from engaging in doping. Under the new legislature, violation of the anti-doping rules may result in disqualification of result including for future of medals, points of prize, points, prizes, in eligibility to participate in a competition or event for a prescribed period and financial sanction. The bill provides for constituting NADA as a statutory body headed by the Director General appointed by the central government. The function of the agency include planning, implementing, monitoring anti-doping activities and investigating anti-doping rule violation. It also seek to give effect to the United Nations Educational, Scientific and Cultural Organization against the doping in sports and compliance with such other obligation and commitments. With the reference to the trade deficit, consider the following statement. If a trade deficit increases, GDP of a country decreases. That's a good idea. Higher the trade deficit can decrease the local currency value. This is a very good thing. So, trade deficit is a very good thing. It is a very good thing. It is local currency value. It is a very good thing. Which are the incorrect? D. It is a very good thing. It is a very good thing. 
Trade deficit is one of the factor. One of the factor used to calculate country's gross domestic product GDP को निकालने में बहुत इस्तेमाल किया था. Measures of the size of the economy. If the trade deficit अगर trade deficit लगातार बढ़ते चला जाएगा ना, तो सब अभी किसका क्या मतलब है? इसका मतलब आप import ज़्यादा कर रहे हैं ना? इसका मतलब आपके देश में उत्पादन हो ही नहीं रहा कुछ ही. तब ना आपका trade deficit लगातार बढ़ता जा रहा है. इसका मतलब आपका GDP गिर जाएगा. Higher trade deficit can decrease the local currency's value. This is because the demand for current foreign currency. अगर आप लगातार बाहर से चीजों को खरीदेंगे तो उसकी तो foreign currency का requirement होगा और foreign currency का requirement का मतलब dollar और पर रुपया लगातार लगातार बढ़ रहा है. This is because the demand for currency is foreign currency is more than the foreign demand for the local currency. India का trade deficit जो है वो बहुत बड़ा हो गया है. वो लगभग लगभग 31 billion dollar के आसपास पहुंच चुका है. अगला क्वेश्चन है चंडलर बोबल ये क्या है चंडलर बोबली बोबली चंडलर बोबली से सुपर से रोटेशन ऑफ अर्थ वाओ चंडलर बोबली या फिर चंडलर वेरिएशन ऑफ लैटिट्यूड इज ए स्मॉल डेविएशन इन द अर्थ एक्सिस ऑफ रोटेशन रिलेटिव टू द सॉलिड अर्थ व्हिच वाज डिस्कवर्ड बाय द नेम अमेरिकन एस्ट्रोनॉमर सेफ कार्लो चैंडलर चैंडलर बोवल इज एन एग्जांपल ऑफ द काइंड ऑफ द मोशन दैट कैन अकर फॉर अ फ्रीली रोटेटिंग ऑब्जेक्ट दैट इज नॉट अ स्पेयर दिस इज कॉल्ड फ्री फ्री न्यूटेशन समवट कंफ्यूजिंगली द डायरेक्शन ऑफ द अर्थ रोटेशन एक्सिस द डायरेक्शन डायरेक्शन ऑफ द अर्थ डायरेक्शन ऑफ द अर्थ रोटेशन एक्सिस रिलेटिव टू द स्टार आल्सो वेयर इज डिफरेंट प्रीयर्स This means, this means, this motions caused by tidal forces of the moon and sun are also called nutation, except for the slowest, which are precessions, precessions of the equinoxes. This is the phenomenon caused by the shortest day, according to the scientist. Consider the following statement about Criminal Procedure Act 2022. The act empowers the authorities to collect physical and biological samples of person detained under the any preventive detention law (CRPC). CPA, CPA 2022 का जो आइडेंटिफिकेशन क्रिमिनल प्रोसीजर उसके बारे में पूछा जा रहा है द एक्ट इम्पावर्स द अथॉरिटीज टू कलेक्ट फिजिकल बायोलॉजिकल सैंपल ऑफ पर्सन डिटेन अंडर द प्रिवेंटिव डिटेंशन लॉ रिफ्यूजल टू गिव डेटा इज कंसिडर्ड एन ऑफेंस अंडर द एक्ट नेशनल क्राइम रिकॉर्ड ब्यूरो इज ए सेंट्रल एजेंसी टू मेंटेन द रिकॉर्ड ऑफ कलेक्टेड सैंपल विच आर द करेक्ट आई थिंक ओनली एंड ओनली टू वन टू थ्री बहुत ऑल आर करेक्ट क्रिमिनल प्रोसीजर आइडेंटिफिकेशन एक्ट 2022 को बढ़ा दिया गया भैया द टाइप द टाइप ऑफ डेटा दैट मे बी कलेक्टेड पर्सन फ्रॉम होम सच डेटा मे बी कलेक्टेड द ऑथोरिटी दैट मे ऑथोराइज सच कलेक्शन पर्सन डेटा मे बी कलेक्टेड कॉन्विक्टेड और अरेस्टेड फॉर एनी ऑफेंस हाईवर बायोलॉजिकल सैंपल मे बी टेकन फॉर्सिबली ओनली फ्रॉम पर्सन अरेस्टेड फॉर द ऑफेंस अगेंस्ट वुमेन और अ चाइल्ड और इफ इट द ऑफेंस इज कैरीज ऑफ ए मिनिमम सेवन ईयर्स इम्प्रिजनमेंट पर्सन डिटेन अंडर द एनी प्रिवेंटिव डिटेंशन लॉ ऑन द अदर द ऑर्डर ऑफ द मैजिस्ट्रेट फ्रॉम एनी पर्सन नॉट जस्ट एनी अरेस्टेड पर्सन टू एड इन्वेस्टिगेशन कठिन कर दिया गया Under this act, the resistance or the refusal to give data will be considered an offence. If you don't give it, then you will be offensed. The obstructing a public servant from doing his duty. You are stopping his duty. Okay, son. You are giving him a beating. 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 या फिर किसी छोटी बच्ची के साथ आपने कुछ गलत काम किया हो तो जितने भी महिलाओं के साथ कुछ रेप उप से जुड़ा हुआ मामला हो उसमें मुंह में आपका डंटा ठूस के आपसे उगलाया जाएगा बात 
इस एक्ट के तहत नेशनल क्राइम रिकॉर्ड ब्यूरो एन सी आर बी विल बी देंट्रल एजेंसी टू मेंटेन द रिकॉर्ड इट विल शेयर द डेटा विद द लॉ इन्फोर्समेंट एजेंसी फर्दर द स्टेट या फिर यू टी मे बी मे बी मे बी नोटिफाई एजेंसी टू कलेक्ट प्रिजर्व एंड शेयर डेटा इन देयर रिस्पेक्टिव जूडिक्शन द डेटा कलेक्टेड विल बी रिटर्न इन डिजिटल और इलेक्ट्रॉनिक फॉर्म फॉर पचहत्तर साल तक रहेगा रिकॉर्ड्स विल बी डिस्टोर्ड इन द केस ऑफ अ पर्सन हु आर एक्वेटेड आफ्टर द ऑल अपील्स लेकिन अपील सारे अपील के समाप्त हो जाने के पश्चात अगर आपको रिहा कर दिया जाता तो सारे डेटा को रिस्टोर डिस्टोर कर दिया जाएगा रिलीज विदाउट ट्रायल बिना ट्रायल का छोड़ दिया जाए तो भी आपका डेटा मिटा दिया जाएगा लेकिन आपको अगर सात साल की सजा हो गई अगर सजा अगर भोग कर चुके हैं तो आपका डेटा पचहत्तर साल तक रहेगा Like is come into the effect. Answer the following statement: Life style for environment. Life is an intergovernmental or national lead by India and France to bring individual behaviors at the forefront of the global climate action narrative. Life in reason. आर द प्लेसिंग दी प्रिवेलेंट यूज एंड डिस्पोज इकोनॉमिक विथ ए सर्कुलर इकोनॉमी यूज एंड डिस्पोज को रिप्लेस कर देगा ये द लाइफ ग्लोबल कोल लाइफ ग्लोबल कोल फॉर आइडियाज एंड पेपर्स इज एन इनिशिएटिव ऑफ द गवर्नमेंट ऑफ इंडिया टू इनवाइट पेपर्स या आइडियाज From across the world to derive climate-friendly behaviors, which are the incorrect. I think first is incorrect because the concept of life style for environment was introduced by Indian PM, 26th United Nations Conference Climate Change COP 26 in Glasgow in 2021, which used people to make change in one's life style. that would contribute to us saving the environment life is the first of its kind global movement led by indian partnership with other countries that will provide the world with a unique people powered platform to relentlessly focus on bringing individual and collective action to core of the climate action narrative the life in vision replacing the prevalent huge and disposable economic governed by the mindless and destructive consumption with a circular economy which would defined by the mindful and deliberate utilization the mission intends to nudge individuals to undertake simple acts in their daily lives that can contribute significantly to the climate change when embraced across the world the launch also initiated the life goal for the ideas and papers inviting individuals universities think tankers non profit others worldwide to submit a measurable and a scalable behavior change solution that can drive climate friendly behaviors mission raptar project is is associated with it's a road it's a rail transport mission raptar mission raptar is a mission in vision for speed enhancement and to achieve a target of doubling average speed of freight trains and increasing the average speed of super fast ya mail express train by 25 km per hour the mission there is a marked improvement in the average freight train after the speed consider the following statement about maintenance and welfare of the parents and senior citizen act 2007 children are under legal obligation to maintain their either or other
maintain either or both of their parents according to this act the definition of the parents in this act means father or mother of only biological nature only biological nature no only a is right maintenance and welfare of the parents and senior citizens act 2007 ek kanun hai jo ki ministry of social justice empowerment dwara laya gaya hai ताकि एक तरह से इफेक्टिव प्रोविजन दिया जा सके प्रबंधन किया सके वेलफेयर के लिए माता पिता को और सीनियर सिटीजन के लिए एक तरह से कानूनी दायित्व तो उत्पन्न कर देता है बच्चों पर और उसके उत्तराधिकारियों पर ताकि वो अपने सीनियर सिटीजन अपने माता पिता को एक निश्चित मेंटेनेंस दे एक मंथली अलाउंसेस दे इट ऑल्सो प्रोवाइड सिंपल स्पीडी एंड इन एक्सपेंसिव for the protection of life and property of the older person parents means father mother whether biological adoptive ho step mother ho step mother ho step father ho koi bhi dikkat nahi hai father or not father nor mother in a senior citizen thank you